not a whole lot of choice of who this might belong to, though. It's probably that guy down that way a bit on the map. Unless for some reason it doesn't take us to, like, a person. But from what I remember these types of missions before it usually take us to, like, somebody for more missions or something on those lines. I actually only have about two and a half minutes left. Oh, okay. Well, that's not a person. <laughs> that is nowhere near a person. There we go. And now I guess we just continue. So I guess that was a red herring. I thought for a second that... Yeah, I guess it did take us to... This looks like it might be an Orochi agent here. It will probably be the second person we go to after we finish up with Mr. Werewolf. Oh hey, it's one of the messengers. Let's go ahead and follow them, I think, maybe. That's probably another messenger right there. So... Actually, I don't know then. Which way are we heading? Uh, I guess it wasn't this way. I'll figure this out later, though. First, we have to head all the way back to where we were up there. Or we could Anima Leap, but it seems kind of lazy to do that, especially in a new zone like this. I see some still points here because I'm working on getting this hammer all the way up. Looks like I'm one point off though. And our last miska slot is now done, so now we have to figure out what we're going to work on first. I guess maybe we'll just go clockwise around and do blades first because if I have to switch a weapon, it's probably going to end up being to hook blades. Because I see blades used a lot. Alright, what do you got for us here? so pure as a beast. Yet that is how the vampire treats our kind. Rabid animals leashed to their wars. Trophies to flay for our good skin pelts. This is all the young packs have ever known, so they submit. Are made depraved. I shall teach you history. The vampire and we are rooted from the same evil. All bastard children of Lilithu None of us meant to belong in the natural world. We who could not cover our teeth grew lean in the wildernesses. They became fat from your cities. Still, they are deformed things with no sense, no breath. 
only a thin thread of control. And when it breaks, the muzzle is slipped. They slaughter like us. Show them. Remind them of the baseness they share with their dogs. Reveal to the pack what their masters truly are. Then Claw and Fang will meet in killing embraces, as it must be. Blood to darken the snow. The shared blood of monsters. Alright. Time to kill some werewolves again. Though it looks like this mission might not be as long as the other one was. Only four tiers. But we'll see. Seems like the storm is getting a bit worse. I may end up having to cut this short or something. Though I at least want to get through this mission. Some sort of ice golem down that way too. Uh, that might be where the other side mission right there might be, is in that cave. There are another two sets of ramparts down this way. That's all I need, really. Whoops, well, I got some. Not the ones that I intended to get that were next to the fire, but. Kill ten vampires. Okay. Well, I still want to see with this with the side missions right over here or not. Yep, it is. And there are vampires over here. I wonder if these would count or not. Probably not. Oh yes, they do. Clear the area of young Turk vampires. 20 of them. Oh, man. This is going to be a bit of a side thing because we're kind of not even supposed to be in this area, but... Oh, 
with this done, I've basically cleared out this entire corner of the region of stuff then. So I think that other guy that has the missions is the first thing next. Luckily none of these enemies are particularly difficult. These guys, I thought they'd be difficult, but most of the time they're just doing slow AoE attacks and it's like, eh. Only good thing is I don't have to kill another 10 Pacific Vampires, because it's making both of them go up. Ooh, lore piece over in the corner. We'll definitely go and get that in a second. So I'm not too particularly sure about this region so far. It wasn't actually what I pictured it would probably be. I think maybe I was picturing something more along the lines of like ancient vampire ruins or something. I got that right on up, didn't it? I <laughs> wonder if I could find another bunch of vampires around here like that. Well, that's a different one. Executor. And he casts slow on me. That's probably why those AoEs. Reminds me of those, uh... Reminds me of that mission that we did over at the theme park in Solomon Island. I think it was at the Savage Coast, where it was like the end part of it was fighting, I think, an Orochi agent that was just chucking a grenade AoEs on the ground constantly. something that allows them to get more health but it doesn't help them enough because it doesn't give enough back quick enough. Yeah, this will do. Man, I hate that thing that they do where they knock you back. It's just more frustrating than anything because it doesn't do anything. There we go. That's 20 down. Stake the dead at the vampire encampment, which is like, I think, right next door. I 
So I think I'm just gonna skip around here and try not... <laughs> try not to get caught by any enemies best I can and just sort of go around. I'm gonna ignore those. <laughs> Do I really have to go up that mountain again? That's what it almost looks like. But I'm not sure if this was the one from... Yeah, it is the one, because it has the tracks here. Oh boy. Yeah, if I went up that mountain like this, this probably wouldn't turn out very well, so I'm gonna go ahead and drop some of these enemies. And then try and head back up there. They're going pretty far, aren't they? this over here the Sun Temple I think this might be where the anima teleport is the animus yeah that looks like one of the entrances I don't know if you actually have to touch them or not anymore because usually before they were sealed until you actually like came up and interacted with them but I have no idea if they actually still do that or not Though rarely you ever have to actually leave the region that you're in to get something done. I think sometimes in investigation missions, like the one we did in the last zone, early on was the first time in a long time. Only other time I could think of would be the Hall Halloween events or any sort of event like that. Okay, it's yeah, it's up that way. Fight my way through, I guess. I'd say I just run past all these, but since it's all just narrow pathways and it's basically spiring up a mountain, it would take a long time to actually get rid of them.
Well, it looks like we're heading up somewhere we haven't been before, finally. Okay, now we're looking at like some castle ruins or something like that. I like this a bit better. Dragon's Ascent. And there are some of the same vampires that we had before up here as well. But where are we supposed to stake them out is the question. Ah, now I see. I'm on the wall here. This guy has like either a lot of health or he has something that's really difficult to actually counter as far as healing goes. But now he's starting to lose health. There we go. Drop an item of some sort. Health. Don't really need that, I don't think, but whatever. That's a talisman. Oh, okay, there's a random cabin over here. Looks like there's also a side mission over this way too. Another one of these house guys right outside of it.
tracking device. Ah, it's one of these things. Okay. Old school necromancer. Or if he has the evidence that we need. has a computer in here, that's kind of weird. <laughs> it's like this cabin out in the woods and it has a working computer. Don't really see anything so far, it's kind of... Hmm. Ah, there we go. Ah, it was on the table, okay. The werewolf elders all the way back towards where we started at, so maybe we could... Hmm... Not what I wanted. Okay, yeah, we're just gonna animal leap over there. There we go. The perfect crime. Observe the chaos you've created. Oh, man. Oh, I guess there's something in here we actually have to find. That one guy off to the side's like, yeah, I'm not getting involved with this. Ah, here we go. Finish this up fairly quickly though, because as soon as one of the sides over there kill each other, then uh, whoever's left over is going to probably immediately attack me. And there we go. Dogs of War completed. Now let's get out of here. Actually, no, they're passive, so that works out for us.